hello hi how are you i hope you're good this feels a little weird uh filming just you know face to face in front of my camera because i've been filming a lot of reading vlogs recently and that's really on the go just wherever i go this is with my giant camera and it's just i haven't done this in a while so it's strange um but i hope you guys are good i am here today with my september tbr these are all the books that i hope to read in september i'm really happy with myself with last month because i actually basically completed my entire TBR. I read seven books and I finished the last book, Caraval, today, which, so it was slightly rolled over, but just a little. So I basically read everything that I wanted to, so I'm really happy about that. But uh, let's jump into my TBR for this month because I'm super excited for all of the books. Okay, so first up, I have Emerald Green by Kirsten Gear. This is the third and final book in the Ruby Red trilogy. This is a young adult uh, fantasy time travel thingy. Um, we follow basically a family of time travelers that are trying to unlock this hidden, um, I would say, power that they're trying to just um, access, uh, but people are trying to stop them for reasons that are unknown. I still don't know why yet, so um, I'm, I'm hoping that everything is wrapped up in the third and final book. I've been enjoying them for the most part um, over the last couple of weeks, so hopefully uh, the third book is satisfying and doesn't end horribly, fingers crossed. Um, the next book that I really want to read that I'm so excited for is Middle Game by Seanan McGuire. Now I love Seanan McGuire. I haven't read her I would say most well-known books, which are the the Wayward Children, the you know, those small little books that everyone has read on booktube. I haven't read those, but I love her books under her pen name Mira Grant. I read her Feed trilogy, which were about zombies, and I read um, Into the Drowning Deep, which, which was about killer mermaids. That was so good, so intense. I highly recommend that one. And so I heard about middle game and honestly this cover is what drew me in but also because Shauna McGuire. I don't know a single thing about this book except that I think Books and Lala really like this one a lot so I just I had to get it. It was for free when I was doing like trading for books at a used bookstore so I'm really looking forward to this one. If you've read it let me know what you thought. Um, the next one I have is interesting. Normally I wouldn't have picked something like this up at all except I really love uh, the YouTuber and that is Alexa Dunn um, over at her her YouTube channel Alexa Dunn. Uh, she is a writer and so her book is called Brightly Burning and she talks a, a lot about it on her channel. Um, this is a retelling of Jane Eyre set in space I believe and I've never read Jane Eyre, so I don't know if this is smart reading this having not read the source material, but I want to read it anyway, just to just to read it and, you know, support the author and whatnot and just see what I think because I think she has another book that's also sort of a retelling perhaps, uh, but I follow her channel a lot, I really like her content, so I want to read her book and just see if I like it, so fingers crossed, it's good. Uh, if you've read it, let me know what you think. Um, next, I want to read Legendary by uh, Stephanie Garber, which is the sequel to Caraval, which I read, you know, I finished the book today, and it ended actually really well, so I'm eager to pick up the second book. Um, I've heard a lot about uh, Caraval on book two, but I haven't seen a lot of people continue the series, so I'm interested in seeing how it continues, if it gets better, if it gets a worse, hopefully better. So, and that book is about, I would say, a like a carnival with a lot of magic and a lot of hidden secrets and just a lot of kind of like uh oh I don't want to say but I, if you're interested in caravel I think it's kind of like a like a downgraded version of the night circus in a way but they're completely different but I mean like if you like the night circus you might like caravel um, the next thing that I want to read, the next two things that I want to read, are actually manga, and that is One Piece. One Piece. Where is the cover? Here is the cover. Yes. So I have volumes one through three, and then four through six, these big old bind-ups. Now, One Piece, I've been told over the years, time and time again, to read because it's about pirates. So I should have picked it up forever ago, but I never did. But actually, the reason why I'm reading it now is because my boyfriend, his favorite thing in the entire world is basically One Piece. So I need to read it because of that, but also because pirates, and I'm really excited. I already started um, the first bind-up, uh, just the beginning, so I'm not very far, but I like it a lot, and then afterwards I plan on watching the entire anime, which I hear is forever and ever uh, long. It's very long. It will take a long time to watch, so 
Yep, but I want to I want to watch it. So uh, the last book I have uh, is in the vein of pirates, and that is Song of the Current by Sarah Tolser. Tols I can't pronounce the last name. I'm sorry. I actually don't know much about this book, but I know that it has pirates. It's a young adult book involving pirates, and that's all I really need to know in a book. If it has pirates, I want to read it. So yeah, that's that's all I know. Um, I'm excited to read this nonetheless, but I saw it at the library and I remembered that th I had seen this book on booktube and that it was about pirates, so I, I checked it out and that's my story with that. And that is my TBR for September. I'm really looking forward to all of these books. I'm super excited. Um, I would love to read even more, um, but seven books is the goal. Seven books. So we'll see what happens. Um, anyway, I hope you guys are having a great week. I hope you're having a great reading week and I hope you're just doing great and I will see you in another video very soon. Bye!